Hey, what's up guys? How's everybody doing today? Hope everyone's doing all right. So what I did with my uh, Ishin EO12 was did a little bit of modification on it. And um, well, first thing, this is the original battery to the Ishin EO12. And this one has a micro JST connector, which is super tiny. And since this here fits all of these other batteries, which is like the regular size Ishin, like one of these. Since this little thing, the battery tray fits this, what I did was I unsoldered the micro JST connector inside and then I added the wire with the bigger JST connector, which is a 2.0 JST connector. So now I'm able to run this little drone with the regular size battery from the Ishin or the JJRC, which is one of these. All right, and it actually works. It flies really good, it flies even longer. It's a little bit more powerful than you know the standard little stock battery with the micro JST connector. And yeah, I'm, you know, I'm really satisfied with it. The results is good. It even fits this battery. This super long Gaoning 450 milliamp ADC 1S battery. This thing fits in here, but the only problem is it's too heavy to take flight. So that's the downside on that, but it fits. Anyways, I wanna show you guys the flight with the Ishin EO10 battery and a JJRC H36 battery inside an Ishin EO12 micro. All right, so uh, let's, let's do it. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna start off with the Ishin EO10 battery. All right, it's a 150 milliamp 45C. This the original drone for this battery is right here. All right, so what, what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna test this out and see how it does with this little micro Ishin EO12. All right. So let's do it. All right, so I'm, I'm doing this in uh, mode three, which is the fastest mode. And I just want to test out this battery, see how many juice it gives or punch or whatever. Oh yeah, oh yeah, crash it up. So far so good. Yeah, so far so good with this Ishin EO10 battery. So I'm gonna bring it in and then we'll try the JJRC battery. All right, so let's try the JJRC battery.
pretty good. It has good punching power. It's, it's flying really nice. There's no jitter. There's no like little short stop on circuits. Overall, this is pretty good. I'm really pleased that I could switch off batteries like this besides having just one battery with the micro JST connector. Now I can just keep switching off batteries whenever I want, just like the regular Ishin. Alright, there you have it. Ishin EO12 Super Micro Modified. I also took a pocket screwdriver, like a really small one, and then I, I drilled a hole on top just to pull out the antenna. Looks pretty wicked with the antenna sticking out. Oh yeah. Thanks for tuning in guys. Hope you learned something.